video, I'm going to show you how you can generate a QR code. QR codes can serve multiple purposes. One purpose is to direct customers to your order online page, to your app, to your menu, to your website. It has many different ways of getting customers a call to action. So let's suppose you want your customers to come to this page so they can order online from here. <clears throat> or you want your customers to come here so they can download your iOS or Android app. Um, you can serve both functions. So I'm going to show you how to do that. So the first thing you would do is you go to Google and type in QR code generator. And once you type this, uh, try to find a, Q, a good QR code generator. The one that have ads next to it, uh, don't get those because those are those you have to pay. Unless you want to pay, you can. Um, but because there are free ones. So this one here is a free one. So click on this one right here. Um, so this is a basic QR code generator and it serves the purpose that we need it for this video. If you want something more advanced, then it has a feature where you can uh, pay for it or do other things. So I'm going to have customers go to this page here. So all I do is I paste the URL. So if your website is mikespizza.com, you're going to write mikespizza.com here. But in this case, uh, we're directing them to the order online page. So once you do that, you're going to press download. So here's a tricky part where most people kind of get confused. When you, once you press download, you'll see this message here. You don't have to make an account. It's actually downloading. See at the very top, it says your, your, your QR code is being generated. So just be patient. It'll do it by itself. Once your QR code is generated, you'll see it here. And then all you do is you go to Microsoft Word or some kind of Word document, um, web, Word document like Google Docs. And take that and paste it here. So if you're going to use Google, if you can use Microsoft Word, um, all you do is you just take this QR code and write some text on there. So I'm going to send this to the back. Okay, the reason why I'm sending it to the back is that way I can write text uh, above it. So uh, let's see here, change, let's see, send to back, let's see how I can do this. Actually, wrap text, wrap text um, behind text, okay? So that means now I can actually write around it. There we go, I can write above it. Um, please, uh, actually, I'm gonna write scan QR code below to view our online order page and or or to download our iPhone or Android app okay so I'm gonna go ahead and make this big as you can see it's very small it's hard to see that I'm gonna make it like 48 size actually that's too big let's make it 36 I'm going to make the page width a little bit wider because it's not that wide. I'm going to make it narrow. There we go. I'm going to center it. Um, so you press home. Typical Microsoft Word stuff I'm doing here. Scan QR code below to view our online order page or to download. So I spelled download wrong here. So I'm going to have to fix that. Okay, download. So you want to see if it's correct for you to use everything capital, capital letters or not. So uh, to view our order online page. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna make this into two sentences. Um, okay, so I'm gonna do it like that. Um, it's centered okay and I'm gonna make this also centered see if I can do that actually I can move this centered okay so um, and again you can get more creative as you wish um, so you can put your uh, business logo up here you know um, once you put your business logo up there so how do you get your business logo pretty simple and straightforward you go to your website um, you can get it from here and then you can upload your business logo you just press save image as um and then just it's a logo okay give it a name and then you can actually add that here as well so once you do that um now you can add your logo here so i can go here and press insert um let's see media pictures yeah pictures from file and then downloads logo 
Okay, oh, this is, I don't know if I have to make this taller here. Hold on, I put too much space here. So again, I, I'm just showing you one example, okay? So now what you can do with this is you can actually um, print this multiple times, put it on your window, put it at the counter, put it in the back room, uh, hand it to customers. Uh, you can also download our iPhone and an Android app. Okay, so you can do many things with this flyer here, okay? So, and get creative. Uh, I'm just showing you a quick way of doing it, and you can see it's pretty straightforward, pretty simple. People will scan it, they'll take them to that page, they'll download your app, and they'll order online. All right, um, feel free to subscribe to our YouTube channel to get more tips like this. All right, thank you so much. Have a great day.